these streets feel like home. The traffic jams, both machine and human. Big cars, small needs. They grab onto things or let them go. Just like we do. People living in tall buildings. Others just living. People trying to be rich. People being rich. People who have no time. Or people who just wait. Just like we do. At night, the rain sounds the same. So do the promises of every morning. Familiar strangers, distant friends, Hearts beating with 2G, 3G, 4G. Eyes on the future. Promises of much, much more. This place is just like home. Well, almost. there is something different. This peace, this calm, this rhythm has a charm. All I see around me are people. And these words, yes, these words surround me. Somewhere hidden in these words, perhaps lies the secret. My mother and my father is a teacher, you know, and, and in, my, in my family, my grandpa is good at uh, calligraphy. Uh, after I uh, grew up, you know, as a, my, my major is the Chinese literature, and, uh, and I will, after I graduate, I will be a teacher, and so I should be good at uh, calligraphy, so that's why. And uh, when I learned the calligraphy, I found it uh, is very, the calligraphy is a very uh, magic thing. From the beginning, I should learn it. It was nine years old. Very early, very early. I first encountered this thing when I was three years old. Until now, I feel that after learning it, I feel that the meaning of it, the history behind it, the meaning of it, and the meaning of it, and the meaning of it. It helped me to, to calm down. You know, <laughs> if you if you feel very sad or something, uh, you, you can't write the calligraphy very good. So um, you must be focused on the, the calligraphy, focused on the, the pen. Then you can, you can write the, uh, the good calligraphy and the training, training to focus on something. 
很多的东西在里头，靠什么？汉字跟那个西方的那些文字不同，它就是它的一个结构，结构，笔画的结构，笔画的结构。那么这笔画我们好办，大家小时候开始学毛笔，就是什么？先学什么？点、横、撇、捺，对吧？那个老师都说，哎呀，这一横写得好，那一点写得好，这个重不重要？重要，基本功很重要。但是这个只是工具，不是结构。真正的汉字的体现在哪？它的最重要的东西在哪？是在它字的结构。你会一点写得很好，一一横一竖都写得很好，但是如果你整个字的结构掌握不了，这个字的重心在哪儿？体现在曾经讲了一个，就是黄金分割和一个三字塔的那么一个结构东西中，一个字摆那儿稳不稳，不是看你的笔画，而是看你的整个的结构。哎，他把中国书法的文学。哲学、社会对社会、对人生、对自然的很多观点都揉在里头的，是。他中国传统文化的很多方面，通过这个线条，哎，然后通过它的形体展示出来。但这个线条呢，一会西方文字的那种也有线条，但是这个它的那个线条呢，更丰富、更博大。Just like this vast land. With its rivers and mountains, the mountains stand tall, and so do these lines from history. In a modern city of 4.5 million, I can still see people like Liu Shuafu. Hmm, in practicing. 嗯，书法这个东西是中国比较传统的文化，啊，因为，因为呢，现在就是说有很多东西都可以，就是打印呐、啊、或者什么，慢慢的，就是说用笔写的机会比较少了。这个东西如果没人写的话，会失传的。Xu Huaxing sits in this ancient town every day. And he will write your name in six different styles. My Chinese name is Ma Yuan Jun. Yuan Jun 写过差不多有十万多字，大部分他就是先学，但是他他真正来学的还是少。因为我在贵阳的时候，都还有第二个学生，那个已经将近有六十多岁，快七十岁。他的话，他作为爱好，他退了休了，他还是比较喜欢这个艺术。那个的话，我还是给他做了指点，就是教的，呃，他学的时间短，学的时间短嘛，我就是教的教的时间也比较少。Calligraphy master told me that many civilizations have disappeared, for they did not know how to pass on their tradition to the next generation. The Chinese ancient culture has carried on for over 8,000 years. The possibilities are infinite, but I can take only a few. Back with me to the streets back home.